everyone. This is Jen from Adventures On and Off My Anch here. Today I want to show you how to do a couple of things with your uh, with your display, your LCD display on your Anchair bike. Uh, this is the Blue Spark version of this bike. It's a 27 and a half inch. So if you don't have an LCD monitor that looks like this, I can't help you. <laughs> but if you do, then uh, here's a couple of things that you need to know or that you might just want to know. So one thing you'll notice is that this is vertical and it's a digital screen. So if you have a screen other than this one, this is not going to work for you. You'll also see that this is what the controls look like. So we're going to turn it on. It's nice and backlit. Um, you'll see that I have mine set to miles per hour and that my trip is at mile. If you hit the I button, you'll cycle through things at the bottom. So right now I have 80 miles on this odometer, uh, it, the time that I've been riding, but that's not going to show anything because obviously I haven't been riding. Uh, my max mile per hour, my average mile per hour. When you get this out of the box, it's going to be set to kilometers um, because it's made in China. So this is what happens. So in order to change that, you're going to hit the plus and the minus button at the same time and hold them down. And you'll see that you come into a, a menu where you can change things. Now, um, this is the trip distance. I don't know what these letters stand for, but that is an N. And if you want to change, if you want to reset your trip distance, you're going to want to move that to a Y. And I just did that by pressing the up button. In order to save that, you press the I button again. This is the backlight. You can take the backlight up or down. One, two, three. Three is the highest. One is the lowest. I don't want to change it. I like it the way it is. So we're going to do that. We're going to leave it. Ch hit the info button again, and that'll save the changes. The, I, this is the unit setting. This is where you want to change it either from mile per hour, which is one, or kilometer per hour, which is two. So that will dictate this mile per hour and any mileage that you have down here. So I want mine set to mile per hour, so it's one. So I hit that info button to save that, and then we're back at the trip. Now, um, if you want to come into more settings, you hit, after this, you hit the plus and the minus button and hold it down for a couple of seconds. I don't honestly know what any of this stuff does, so I'm not going to change it, but I am going to take you through what it is. Um, SCA, I don't know. I haven't been able to find anything on it, and this is what I'm talking about when I say you can't find Jack out there about this bike. So I'm kind of fumbling through this. I don't know what that is, so I'm not going to touch it. Um, this, I believe, is the level of electric assist. So you have levels 0 through 5. You can change that by only having one through five, zero through seven, one through seven, zero through nine, one through nine. I'm actually going to change that and then go on to the next one, which actually that's it. So then in order to get out of there, you just turn the power off. Now I'm going to turn the power back on and I'm going to see one, two, this is your electric assist level, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now I have nine levels of electric assist if I want it. Um, although I got to go back in there because I went with one and I need to have it say zero to nine. So you'll notice when I come out of here, I'll show you again that my trip monitor, um, there we go. Now I've got it changed from zero to nine. So we're going to turn it off, turn it back on. And turning it off and on is the only way I've found that you can get out of there. But now you'll see the trip monitor or the trip, uh, trip odometer is set to zero. But now, see, I can, oh, no, it's not letting me go down to zero. Maybe I didn't change it. Hold on. Or maybe I didn't commit to the changes. And down info. Okay, now we'll try it again. 
let's see. Yep, there we go. Now we're at zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine levels of electric assist. They say there's five. I have nine. <laughs> I think, you know, everybody has nine. I, I, I guess, I don't know if it maybe, I, I don't know. I can't really make any speculations about that. But anyway, that's how to change at least your amount of electric assist, your uh, distance measurements from mile, from kilometer to hour, per hour, kilometers per, I can't speak today, kilometers per hour to miles per hour, and your, um, re to reset your trip mileage. So thanks for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a like, hit the subscribe button, and also make sure to hit the little bell so that you are notified every time I post a new video. Thanks everyone. See you out on the trail.